So, then there was some barrister who wanted to practice in the end. They started a chamber in Lincoln Sin, which was called a ghetto chamber. Also, I said, I won't go to ghetto chamber. So I started chambers in 1973, when I was not even called to the bar for it. I didn't get people age to start with. After a long time, I got a people age in John Blacksmith, who was called a communist chamber. And even that chamber didn't give me a seat, tenancy. So I came straight from people age plus a squatter, as we call it, however on, to be head of chamber. Because they thought I won't work. But my community supported me. The black community supported me, the Asian community. And I went on the street with them. It was not 1970s, sir, that minority started. The Paki Bashi started in 1968, when that great parliamentarian of yours, Enoch Powell, talked about the river of blood. But, right? And in East London, a Pakistani was killed. Paki Bashi started. And we, and I said in the press was after me, they wanted me to be disbarred. Because I said, we'll fight both inside and outside the court. That was the minority. We were minorities. We were called Pakis. And unfortunately, the Indians were called Pakis. <laughs> As well. Every Asian was a Paki. I started Society of Black Lawyers. Why? Because I was not a minority. The Indian was not a minority. They were black bastards, we were. The term Paki came later on. So we said we are black. Asian, we may be, but we are black and you are black. So the majority in Pakistan it was in the air. So I was a minority in the English bar as well. And I'm still a minority in English. Race relation committee started in my chamber when Lord Justice Brown Wilkinson came because I happened to be addressing in Sussex University when the American lawyers had come on running me trust and saying this English war, they are racist. So he came. And the, finally, the English bar accepted yes. There is a race relation problem, it's not color blind, earlier they said. So we were minority in the bar as well. The law society, there was not a single solicitor here. And the law society president shouted, it's a long time ago, you were not attacking me. Because I said not only bar, but the solicitors also. So the minority I know and you are a minority. But what? J. Salik has done, and I have always been an admirer, I heard his name, <coughs> fighting in great difficulties. <coughs> but then I met him for the first time, and I then saw what a person he is, great man. I went to see the Chief Justice, when Chief Justice was out, thrown out. And I met Mr. Salik there. Then I addressed a press conference, then he was with me there, then I went to his house. And then I saw how hard, what kind of work he is doing. Great work, but something he's done great. This parliament <laughs> that he talks about minority. You see, apart from Sikhs, my brother here, and some other people like Buddhist, maybe, Buddhist, I don't think, Jain, everyone is a minority and a majority. You see, I and him and him and him, Pakistani Muslims, are majority in Pakistan. We burn his churches there. We go and sentence in blasphemy laws. And then here, we burn Salman Rushdie's books. We say to the majority, Oh, blasphemy laws. The majority said, we don't want it. We tried to impose our morals on them. 
we are a minority here, we are a majority there. The Indians in South Hall, they are minority here. In India, they are majority. So, the Christians are majority here. So, the majorities who become minority because of economic reasons, who are not in their country, then they realize what a minority means, what is, it, what is happening to Salik and other people when I am here, when you are here. We then, the sense of minority comes into us, then we can inform our people in Pakistan that that's wrong. It's happening to us, now we realize what pain it is to be minority. And therefore, he is bringing the majorities, not minorities, parliament will bring the majorities of the world together because they are minorities in other countries. That's a great job he's doing. And I have not only great admiration, but my best wishes, and I'm sure this initiative which you have taken will have support from everybody. The, in Pakistan, of course, situation is different. Even the majority in Pakistan is minority today. Because in Pakistan, there is no human rights. Pakistan is a country where Supreme Court judges are packed in one day and say out, one journal in uniform. You are verbally. They do it. So Pakistani majority is as, as oppressed as the minority. Because there are the guns and boots which deal. And they are a minority, but they have got guns. And therefore, you will only be liberated. You will have the minorities in Pakistan will only have rights when the majority also. So, as one of the speakers said, there, Jay Salik, and you have done it. You have not only fought for the Christian minority, but for the human rights of everybody. That is the great, and you, as a minority, leading the majority in many aspects. And I salute you for that. Thank you very much, my respected colleagues. We all appreciate your efforts.